Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Greg. I am going to go over and update Filecoin. Let you guys know that this one right here is probably pretty much a no-brainer. And uh, the reason why is just this area that's corrected. It's a 98% drop. And it's probably in a really, really good area. It could be in a wave one, two, or something like some, some bullish sequence here. And it's corrected it like 80% of the uh, wave. And that's that's really good spot. But I was trying to suss this out, and uh, Filecoin is one of these older coins. They do strange sequences, and um, I'm not going to go into all the count, but you can see it's a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 here, and then probably 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Telling me this, you know, um, this is uh, a lot of people would say this is probably like a wave one, and it came down for a two, but the issue is back here. You can see this is probably 1, 2 up to complete three four five and then you have another one back here one two and uh, i made a previous video on this about polka dot right i told you guys when these uh wicks come down there like that you want to be careful of those wicks they uh you know because technically according to the rules these are supposed to be they'd be bearish and obviously it wasn't you can see what happens next polka dot did the same thing same thing guys came down and touched the same exact spot and Filecoin, look what it did when it did that. Filecoin went on a massive run of 6,000%. The thing is, is it going to do it again over here? Is it going to do another uh, percentage run over there? So the debate's going to be, is this a one, two, or is it doing a one, two, three, four, five extended third wave with another one, two, three, four, and a five? That's going to be the debate. Where's this going to run to? Good question. You know, these are going to be the first areas you're going to be looking at. If it's pop, perhaps doing the bullish sequence down here, is going to be the 18. And then this area right here, 27, and then up to the 48. And then potentially a blast up there. Um, you know, just looking at the weekly on the RSI data, guys, it's like setting up. You can see here, here's a wave. Then it has another wave, another wave, another wave. And then this peak. No divergence. No divergence, which is uh, not surprising with a coin like this. You still don't have a divergence on that three day. Look how deep this went right over here. You see that? It just easily corrected the whole cycle, getting ready for another wave. Um, still, you got divergence from this wave to this wave on that sequence. But this is telling me something a little bit different is going on with Filecoin. Um, either way, it's a no brainer. I have that uh, box area. And you see where it came down right on top of this area. So the probability of Filecoin like dumping through here is very low, in my opinion, especially with the selling momentum all the way down here in the uh, weekly uh, RSI. Very, very low. It's in a very, uh, I would say very, it is cryptocurrency. I don't know much. I've done a fundamental check on this coin. Did a previous video on it. I was talking about how I could do another blast up. And I still think that it's set up to do that over here. Just realize too, this is the older uh, the older coins, and what they do is they like to hang out in certain areas until they start making their moves, guys. It's going to be a, a patient game with this one, okay? That's one of the reasons why I don't like these coins is they you know, they sit in some spot for an area, and you can really easily miss it uh, if you're not patient with these coins. So, um, and then this is a ninety eight percent drop. It's on top of this support area. It's done a wave up, and then you can see it's corrected it. And uh, you can see right there, very minimal spot. So let's check that out right there. I'll show you. Um, I need to go to the wave sequence. So you can see this is a miniature version of what I just showed you. You see wave one, two, three, possibly somehow four up for a five, and then another one right behind it. The same exact sequence that it's doing. So it's in a really, really good spot. In my opinion, it's a no-brainer. Just based off this over here, you can see there's your stop right there. 478 would be that. And then it came down to 520. That's a very deep retrace, which is giving off characteristics of a pretty decent signal right now. You know, you're looking at, uh, what was it, 90% retrace. I would go from the wick. It's uh, still like 90%. And then you can see the wave taking out that wick. One, two, three, four, five corrected that all the way down it's possibly one two three four five so what's going to happen probably with filecoin guys it's going to be a sequence is all in here for a little while and it's going to do its blast off eventually like i said it's going to be a patient waiting game 
it's in an area right now. It's like it's pretty much a no brainer right here. It's going to be doing a move over here to blast eventually at some point. You might have to. And then again, look, you could miss it or not make it. It just depends on how much you like this coin. It could be a patient waiting game before that happens, or it could happen in, in you know, 30 days or 45 days and setting itself up to get out of there. Because one of the reasons, too, if this sequence, if this is like a sequence where it's one, two, three, four, five, and then one, two, three, four, five, and then there's another one behind it, all of this back here is going to have be support for this wave over here, if that makes sense. So the sequence all works together, even though it's over here and it's done a 98% correction, if this is part of it, all of this works together to to make that wave over here so as an example i'll show you like this this could be you know this could have been the one two and this could have been a three and it came all the way back down for that four if you can believe it it could be doing that over here for that five you know right now it's kind of unbelievable even to think that this coin could go up this high guys um you know that's a that's a potential i wouldn't count on the move like that but it is setting itself up according to the RSI data. Everything's down here, you know, looking at it. Um, it's, it's setting itself up for a massive move. Even if it just, if it, if it's doing a significant bounce, you look at three, four, five, six X, you know, easily probably into those areas guys. So um, starting to notice a pattern here with the cryptocurrency market though, right? How many other assets, you know, are looking like this while well, everybody's still bearish. I mean, to me, it's a perfect setup between the sentiment and the data in the charts. This chart's telling me it's going bullish. Everybody is bearish. Everything is continuing to go down. It's complete market setup. If you really, really take a step back and you think about it, you know, all the videos out about Bitcoin going to 6K, 3K, 8K, 9K. Um, there's even now we're going into a new, uh, you know, S&P 500 is going to be going down to the 2000 levels, which I looked at numbers. That's like eight or 900, which is crazy. I mean, can it happen? It could. But the mega crash, basically, the mega crash uh, deal is coming up right now. So, um, yeah, I would uh, I would definitely be looking at this for sure, guys. I don't like the coin, so I wouldn't be making an entry into it. FYI, not financial advice. I would be doing an entry into it. But the potential definitely is there. As a matter of fact, if I was to do it personally, I would wait to see how this sequence is going to play out. I imagine it's going to be like Fero coin, where it's going to make another wave, take its time again, and then eventually get out of there. Maybe do a blast like this, guys. Easy. I, you know, something like that right there. You, you, you know, that's a 10x, 15x right there. It could easily do something like that over there. It's definitely set up for that. If you made all the way to the end of my video, Drop a like, hit the subscribe button. Peace.